right? Okay. Today, we are back with another JJK reaction video. And Jordan, we are on episode number 11 of season one. And this show is getting good. This show is getting good. And it's getting crazy. Yeah. Hectic. A lot of twists and turns. Right. A lot of soul talk lately. Yeah. A lot of alliances. Right. A lot of mentorship. Mm. Right. Yes. On both sides. Yeah. I like where things are going. Yeah, me too, man. A lot of terms yep. as well that we keep learning about. Idle. Like divergent fist. Divergent fist. Idol transfiguration. Yes. Over time. Over time. <laughs> Which we have not seen yet, but uh, I think that's how the next episode may begin. Really? Over time, right? Did we see? Oh, yeah. I think he is entering overtime. Yeah, because he said something like, I got to stop at 6 p.m. or 6 yeah. o'clock. And then it turned 6 o'clock and he said, okay. Yeah. I got to go into overtime. And we have many comments today about yeah. what happens in overtime. Right. So let's jump in, brother. How are you going right. to start this? You have any takeaways from the previous two episodes? Uh, I don't think I have too many. Um... Like I said, idle transfiguration. We learned about that term. Mahito has this ability can, can, to... Can you provide a definition in language of origin, please? I want to tell you what Mahito, uh, <laughs> Mahito told us it means. Just kidding. He can make contact with the soul and alter its shape. Let me say that again, Jared. He can make contact with your soul and alter its shape. This man is an experimenter yeah he has the biggest human to his right and the smallest human in his left hand yeah um and when he told yoshino just as you eat when you get hungry so it is that you hate someone you can simply kill them i'll sanction you fully this may take a dark twist it's already been very dark but um yeah that stuck out what else there was one other thing i had a question about because when yuji was talking to yoshino that's his name right yoshino yeah when yuji was talking to him yoshino noticed the button on his jacket mm. and he looked down he's like wait on yuji's button, jacket on yuji's jacket so i was wondering what does that button mean huh. to yoshino Ooh. Or symbolize or resemble. What does it mean to Yuji? Yeah, I don't know like, if like a button that. you can press or a button that you button up. I think it was a button on his coat, like like that you button you you button it. You don't press it. No, no, you don't you don't press. It. Got it, got it. I don't think. Maybe you do. <laughs> uh, so I, I had one question about that, and, and I mentioned all the soul talk. Yeah. Um, I don't know if there's only going to be one soul survivor. Ooh. At the end of this, he was so survive. Uh, oh. One of the best songs ever. Yeah. But we'll have to see. Nanami versus Mahito. Yeah. This what, is going to be epic. Yeah. What you got, man? Yeah. Uh, I really enjoyed rewatching these past two episodes. Yeah. Yoshino, and I believe his first name is Junpi. Mm. Junpi Yoshino. He reminds me a little bit of Light Yagami. From death note mm. and i know i make a lot of comparisons of characters to other characters yeah um, but you know yoshino stumbles upon this person with the power to kill and gets intrigued right and also appears to have or be developing a moral outlook moral mm. compass of his own yeah uh and now you know seeing him get beat up seeing his interaction with that dreadful teacher mm. you know he now has power i believe and like during i know we have a great comment about it 
I didn't realize during that interaction with the teacher that he had already been sanctioned mm. by Mahito. Like he could have killed that guy. Mm. I didn't realize that. Yeah, I don't think I was thinking about that either. <laughs> yeah. But so I, I don't know if the light Yagami uh, comparison is fitting, but I, I think it fits. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and then Gojo turned over responsibility of training Yuji over to Nanami. Yeah. And in the English dub, uh, instead of using the term salary man, they said suit turned sorcerer. Mm. And I thought that was a little bit more clear. Uh, but I know some people explained what a salary man was. Yeah, I think Fox gave us yep. a good definition of that. Uh, and then I absolutely loved when Nanami said to Yuji, you faced several life or death situations, but that does not make you an adult. Mm. Realizing your hair is falling out of on your pillow, realizing your favorite bread disappeared from the convenience store, the accumulation of those little moments of disparity in life. Did he say disparity or despair? I cannot I remember, yeah. Uh, in life is what makes a person an adult. Oof. Uh, as one of our patrons said, Nanami does not mince his words, right? He's He gets to the point and he's sometimes short, but that was a moment of wisdom. Yeah. I feel like I took something out of what he said there to Yuji. So when your favorite bread disappears <laughs> from the store. <laughs> yep. Interesting. And your hair falls out. Yeah. Is it like signs of aging and maturity or what i i just took it like like the little moments yeah. in life ah. as you age right make you an adult not you're just thrown into a life or death situation mm. right? a child like yuji was thrown into a life or death situation yeah right he's not an adult yet yeah um, and then we learned about yuji's divergent fist power also that these curses that Nanami and Yuji were fighting were former humans. Oh yeah, yeah. Right? And there's nothing you can do to save someone once they've reshaped. That adds another very intricate layer to all of this. Mm. Uh, and then just a few more notes. Uh, Mahito in episode 10 said, I'm the only person in the world who knows the soul's composition. Yes. Jaram, this man has powerful power a powerful power indeed he can see souls and change the composition of them idol transfiguration don't come anywhere near me buddy then oh. don't summon him don't be yeah. uh don't put negativity out in there yeah, yeah exactly <laughs> uh and i am ready to clock into overtime let's clock in brother let's we go got a lot more work to do yeah and uh, we're going to clock in by uh, reading Kiki's comment. Kiki writes, Mahito was born from the hatred people hold towards other people in their gut. Mm. So he was very much drawn to the negative feelings Yoshino Junpi was having towards other humans. Makes total sense. Yes, sir. Right? And obviously, for me, during our first watch, I didn't catch on to that. Yeah. That he was born from the hatred people hold toward others in their gut. I think part of that is because uh, he's got an old soul. <laughs> Mahito. <laughs> right. Like, and a young soul. And a young soul. Yeah. But he seems like he's he's got a lot of wisdom and he's yeah. been here for centuries yeah, 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 almost. Yeah. yeah. The way that he's mentoring Yoshino. I didn't really catch on to that either the first yeah. watch though. All right. Thank you, Kiki. Thank you, Kiki. Kiki's got another comment here saying... gonna jump in we are on episode number 11 and this one is titled narrow-minded let's go here we go everybody Mahito's feet you like them they ain't bad better than hooves Let's go. Let's go. 
時間による縛りさっきまでは自ら知力を制限していたのか面白い oh boy. <laughs> 私の術式は対象を千分したとき、yep. 7対3の比率の3ラシオ的に弱点とするものです。千分するのは全長やウィングスパンだけではありません。頭部、胴、上腕、全腕の比率の対象として指定できます。そして、Oh, well, damn. Apples? Planes? What the? So now, him revealing it is going to make it even stronger. There you go. Right. Ratio technique collapse. Ah, I Because the building is falling apart, right? Oh. Oh, did he just take him out? His legs off. He took his leg off. Is that the weak spot? Oh, a boss. Oh, okay. Because he put the cursed energy into the wall. <laughs> right? That's why he was saying he could imbue cursed energy into planes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Apples. Chairs. Yeah. Boss, you can clock out now. <laughs> oh, it's gonna cause an earthquake. Look. Did he literally just cause an I earthquake? I think so. <laughs> 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 That's what he Oh boy. There he is with the button again. Ooh. Okay. So a button with a swirl yeah. means that they're a jujutsu sorcerer. Yeah. Okay. And Mahito says you should be nice to them. Right. Because they can hurt you. Right. And he's saying here, but the jujutsu sorcerers are Mahito san's enemy. Yeah. Right. He's just thinking that, I think. Jujutsu is Mahito san's enemy. あ、こういや、気づい。な、この前お前が言った映画館で人が死んでんだ。お、なんか見なかった。こういう肝いのとか。いや、見てないよ。そういうのはっきり見えるようになったの。最近なんだ。うん。そっか。じゃ、もう
完璧主義の人間が全てを投げ出すまでの感情の動きがちゃんと描けてるんだ<笑>まあまあ<笑>、はあだから2は見れたのかなんで僕も最初なんで面白いのか分かんなくてさわざわざ3回見たよグロ描写も2が一番切れてたから辛かったねうん<笑>なんでそこまですんのイタドリ君映画好きなのちょい事情があってさここ最近は映画三昧でもちゃんと映画館でってわけじゃねえんだよな For certain reasons. やっぱり映画館で面白い作品引いた時の感動はでかいよ、うん、オンデマンドも便利だけどさ That's true in our real life, yeah. はでかいよオンデマンドも便利だけどさ最後に行ったのいつだっけ今度おすすめあったら連れてってよえあ,あ、連絡先He just wants a friend, man. Right, Yoshino's hesitant about adding friends at the moment. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, she's smoking. Cook meal.、Mm -hmm. So, this is Ghetto, I believe.、Uh. Oh boy, is that my Hito j o i n s o man. <laughs> Shape shifter. I don't know. Consumption of cursed energy counts toward supplementation of the self. I feel like we're in a high level philosophy college course. Yeah, I get this part. He says, even if I'm pulverized, I won't die as long as I maintain the shape of my soul. I think I get it. But this part. Oh, look at this leg, man. Supplementation of the self. Consumption of cursed energy. We get that part. Consumption of cursed energy. We get that part. When, he, when he's consumed by the cursed energy,、huh. it counts towards supplementation of the self. Like it adds to him, like it allows him to, to regrow. Or... Hmm. Maybe we'll learn more. Yeah, maybe our viewers can help us out.、Yeah. Without spoiling things. それはちょっと大丈夫大丈夫<笑>じゃあ俺これから晩飯だから晩飯して私もすぐ向かいます yeah, they didn't figure out... すぐ逃げてください、wow, strong... right. この事件に加害者側として関わっていたとしても今のイタドリ君ならすぐやられるようなことはないでしょうただこれは監督する立場として大失態<笑>チャランポランの五条さんなら It'll be all good. It's like a, uh, a private security guard who loses track of their client. <笑> right? That's not good. No. What did,、um, did Ghetto say something like Bingo? When he was standing above looking down、mm. in Yoshino and、uh, Yuji? Ah. Like he wants that to happen? Like he wants them to build it? Oh, I forget. Yeah. Interesting. これは監督する立場として大失態チャランポランの五条さんならまだしも
<laughs> so he's scared of Nanami. Yeah. It's okay, it's okay, man. dude. It's okay. He's gonna ask if you want dinner. Oh, Nanami. Uh oh. Oh. Nanami looks different without his goggles on. Yeah. いいえ、いいですね。よかった。すぐいたどり君と交流、そちらに向かいます。一緒にいないんですか。Uh-oh. Right, that's what Mahito really wanted. Mm. おそらく発生してからそこまで時間が経っていない。貪欲に自分の成長を楽しんでいる。お嬢さん、貪欲に自分の成長を楽しんでいる。お嬢さんが戦った特急呪霊は領域展開まで得していた。やつが生きていたらその we might see Yuji face off against Mahito. Mm. <laughs> これは外来種の幼虫だ。毒があるかもしれない。みんな触っちゃダメだ。吸うから拾ってみたら給食の糸こんにゃくだったんです。This dude, man. Oh. Is is that a reference to Jared, I used to freaking love that movie, man. We finally understand a reference. Wilson! Oh my god. With, with the volleyball, right? Yeah. Oh my god. Wilson! Oh. Such a brilliant movie. Yeah. Oh. Wasn't I watched he a, that like 50 times. Wasn't he a UPS driver? Yeah, something like that. Damn. <laughs> It's so brilliant because you put yourself in his shoes. Yeah, yeah. And you're just left with him and Wilson. Right, and you follow along with the mistakes that he made and you're just oh. screaming at your television. Fire. <laughs> he gets it. She loves that he's got a friend. Yeah. Oh, she's drunk. Damn. He's such a sweet kid, too. Oh. Yeah, he doesn't like her smoking. Damn. That's very true. めっちゃいいこと言うな。名言出ちゃったわ。さすがね。いや。いたとりくんのお母さんはどんな人うん。ああ、俺会ったことねえんだわ。父ちゃんはうっすら記憶あんだけど、俺にはじいちゃんがい
殺したくはないな。なんで悪いやつだよ。なんつうか、一度人を殺したら、殺すって選択肢が俺の生活に入り込むと思うんだ。うん命の価値が曖昧になって、大切な人の価値までわからなくなるのが、俺は怖い。人に心なんてない。その考えに救われた。まあ、ヒロソーテンダー。与えてもらった。でも、僕が人を殺すことで、あの魂が汚れてしまうなら、僕に人は、殺せない。Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh my goodness. What's going on? The finger? Is that a finger? No, it looked like a finger. Oh. oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Don't kill her. Don't kill her. Wait. Why does that almost look like Mahito's hair color at the bottom there? No? It might be, Jordan. What are all, the, what are all those hands down there for? Who knows? Those are humans whose souls have been reshaped. I believe we heard Yoshino talk about how if Mahito or someone did that to his mother, yeah, he would feel a type of way.、Mm. Like he'd be upset. But if it were for people who hated him, yeah, it's all right. What the hell is she doing holding a finger? Well, it was right before her. How? I don't know. It, it doesn't look like one of Sukuna's, right? It might be. What other fingers you know of? I don't know. I don't know of any other fingers, but it sort of looked different and weird. That thing looks red. There's many, many different fingers out there, right?、Mm, I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Golly. Alright, let's take a quick minute break. After this, I'll talk about the other one. I'm going to be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, his mother. The corpse of Yoshino. Nah, oh, okay, okay. Wait, wait. At their home, his mother. So just his mother? Yeah, okay. Keep it going. So that is, it is a Sukuna finger. Unsealed Sukuna's finger, his second left arm's pinky finger. Damn. Damn. What the hell? What the そんなの俺はごめんだダメです<笑>知っての通り例の継ぎはぎの呪霊は改造した人間を使う、うん、どうしようもない人間というのは存在しますこの仕事をしている限り君もいつか人を殺さなければいけない時が来る、うん、でもそれは今ではないそれでも殺したくはないな俺は怖い理解してください。子供であるということは決して罪ではない。君にはこれから、よしの順平の監修をお願いします。黒い服は持っていなかったから、母のクローゼットを開けて
for the funeral. Oh. Tommy is gonna eat it. Oh my goodness. So you ran to no shivazadaro. Honeto canesa areba. Stonante cantani no roiko serendio. Hokoro atari on I kai. Kimia hao. Don't tell me, Yuji. Mosco. Caneto himo motea masta. Usungurai ningeni. いや、照れますね。適当に書けつったろ。最優秀賞なんか通らせやがって。ああ、ボーイ。死ぬか。ごめん。で、お前は入賞止まり。ああ。やっぱりかっこいいわ、賞だ先輩。だよね。そう。
でだから There he is. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. You're just gonna have to take him down, Jer. <laughs> and I just got done saying that he seemed like such a sweet boy. Because he is. He was. Here we go. Sounds going to play. <laughs> Lost in paradise. <laughs> Oh, that's not Juju. That's not a Juju stroll, is it? I don't know if we what got one. To the Juju stroll. I don't know if we got one. It said Juju stroll, right? Look. Maybe this is the Juju Straw. That ain't no Juju Straw. Oh. Maybe it was. Then I, th I think this right here is the little preview. Oh. I don't know. Okay. Oh boy, where do we begin, Jordan? Where do we begin? No idea. But one thing I do know is that that outro, yeah, it's not getting old. Oh, the the song? It doesn't get old. No. That's how you know a song is good. Yeah. Yeah, that uplifts us, right? After watching uh, just this depressing ending. I mean, this episode, they set this up brilliantly, right? I mean, you mm. have such a moment between Yuji and Yoshino a budding friendship. Yoshino's mother invites Yuji over for dinner. They have an amazing time. They're laughing. She gets drunk. Yeah. Yoshino's obviously on edge, but he's having a great time, right? He's making a friend. And then Geto and Mahito have to set Yuji up. Mm. Right? They plant the finger. And that's why Geto, when he was standing over them, watching them talk it was like bingo damn or good because it's part of the plan they they set this up like how can you go from literally about to become the closest of friends yeah to the greatest enemies on the face of this earth or world yeah in split seconds rhetorical i guess because i don't know how to answer it oh yeah, what are some of your thoughts? What's about to happen? Um, what happened to the finger? Did they say they're going to take it back to the school? Or did I misread mm. that? They that, didn't have... Sorry, what were you going to say? I didn't catch that. They didn't have Yoshino eat it, did they? Ooh. I, I was a little confused on what happened to the finger. Yeah. Um, but his mother's dead. His mother's dead. We we saw how much she meant to him. And now she's dead. Yeah. So, I mean, 
if that doesn't turn him all the way to the dark side i don't know yeah. what will i don't know man yeah and his first thought was oh it was i believe the kid's name was ito shuta mm. the kid who won that award from paying off the, the actual smart guy but the kid who bullied him yeah so he went directly to the the school this event and because he thought he had left the finger but mm. now it's going to turn in. I feel like it's going to turn into Yoshino placing blame on Yuji. Um, and obviously Yuji trying to stop Yoshino here. I'm trying to wrap my head, <laughs> to be honest with you. Uh, me too. Uh, around everything that's transpiring. I can follow along, but so many things are happening yeah. all at once. Yeah. And we had a plot twist. At least it was a plot twist for me where the finger one of Sukuna's fingers yeah, yeah. is in front of Yoshino's mother. And then she just gets... So, yeah. Now we'll see if Yuji can take him down. Yeah, I don't know. Anything else, man? Uh, just what a scene with Yoshino walking up to the the teacher <laughs> oh yeah what he say he said something like you need to watch this make sure you watch this watch this what happened and what's about to happen right watch this and he rips apart that kid yeah this this was crazy and again in this episode yuji uh who said it to him he said like if was it nanami who said to yuji if you continue this work there will be a time when you are forced to kill someone hmm yeah. And we know where Yuji stands with not wanting to kill another person. Yeah. Uh, so is Yoshino that that person? Yeah. Let's find out, everybody. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching this episode with us. It's getting crazy. We'll see what's about to happen in the next one. See you soon. We love you. Do not forget. Be kind. Keep an open mind, everybody. Peace. Peace.